Hello, I'm doing good. And yourself? Good. I'm uh, the assistant director. I just want to let you know that you can't have all these decorations out here. Okay, so I just took everything from the car and brought it down. This is what we have so far while well, I came yesterday. I just didn't vlog because it was really emotional, but I'm going to actually add more stuff, set up his tree, but so far this is what I have. So I actually got him a six foot tree. Um, I feel like it's going to be a perfect size. Okay, there we go. Okay guys, so this is the tree. Oh my gosh, it looks, <laughs> I did my best fluffing it out, literally. But I'm about to put the ornaments on. It's honestly really tall. I really love how it looks. I also got these, I was looking for like candy canes, but they didn't have any that were like solar powered. So I got like these uh, solar power lights and I'm gonna put them around as well because I really wanted like, you know, something cute like that to get. Put. I'm actually done. Oh, it's so emotional. It's so pretty. Like, so pretty. Look at it. Look at how freaking pretty it is. Oh my goodness. It's so beautiful. It's so freaking pretty. I'm like actually happy how it came out because I was a little nervous. But literally, look at how pretty all the decorations and then the tree came out so perfect. I curved it because the star I have, it doesn't hold it since it's not like a big, big, heavy tree. But look at how pretty. I'm uh, so in love with it. And I know my baby's up there looking down right now. <laughs> He's loving it too. <laughs> no. His stocking, you guys. I think this was the hardest. Putting his stocking. Right now, I'm actually gonna go get me and Gabriel some food to eat because I kind of got a little hungry. Every time I come here, I get a little hungry. It's weird. Like, I be so depressed, I don't really like sleep or eat, but here, like, I just feel tired and I be wanting to eat and stuff. So, I'm gonna go and get food. Probably gonna get his favorite food, either, I don't know what, but one of his favorite foods and then come back and eat. How you doing, sir? Hello, I'm doing good, and yourself? Good, I'm uh, the assistant director. I just want to let you know that you can't have all these decorations out here. Oh. Um, if you stop in our main office on the way out, 
get a copy of our map for the cemetery grounds. It'll tell you what you can have out here and what you can't. Okay. Um, it's on our Facebook's uh, website. Uh, it's on our website. Um, but we've had new changes come out on what you can have out here. Um, and I just wanted to let you know while you're here that this will all be removed as soon as you leave. Because okay. we're in the Yesterday I had set this up. I just set the tree today. So I can't even have any of this up? Or? No. Um, there's uh, specifics on what you can have and what you can't have. And if you stop in our main office and get a copy of our map that we have in there, there's a copy of the rules on the back of that. Um, and those are going to be enforced starting December 1st um, because we've had a lot of issues. One, you're going to have people come out and steal this stuff. Um, unfortunately, that's been one of the bigger things we've had over the last few months is people coming out and actually taking people's decorations. So. Okay. So I'm sorry to tell you that. I know you just set up a lot of stuff, but I just know that my grounds guys are on being enforced right now to do cleanup, um, and they're going to come through and do that. So, okay, sounds good. Okay, all right. <sighs> y'all literally just heard that, y'all. Like, I just literally spent hours doing this. Now I have to take it all down, you guys. Literally, my freaking heart is broken. You guys heard the director come and say, like, they updated the rules December 1st, but I know a lot of this I've, I had here since yesterday, so maybe he's just referring to the tree, but I'm gonna take it down. It literally breaks my heart, because all I wanted was just to have decorations for my boyfriend. <laughs> But now I have to take it down when I took pictures and everything. You know, not know my boyfriend's up there being thankful, but... Right now, when I go to get us food, I'm gonna stop and get, like, the updated form. I literally just had a meltdown. I had called, I FaceTime people's sister because I wanted to show her the grave and everything, you know, the decorations. And she called me down and, like she said, Gabriel knows the thought and the thought, it's the thought that counts. Okay guys, so I got us some Chinese food. I'm so sad, y'all. Like, I'm so sad, but... <clears throat> at least I have the photos and videos, you know? But it's like, it was so pretty. Like, I know when his mom would have seen it. She's gonna love the photos. It's really pretty, but if she would have seen it in person, she would have been so happy. Like, yesterday when I did just the little floor decor, um... She came and she was so happy and in such a good mood, like she loved it. So I'm gonna head back. I'm literally, I'm thankful this Chinese food place was only 11 minutes away. So now I know, you know, whenever my I want to come and have lunch with my boyfriend, that it's just down the street. So I'll see you guys once I get back to visiting Gabriel. <laughs> I hate having to even say that. Like, I hate that this is my reality. I hate that this is my life. Like, people don't realize how fucking hard it is. I hate looking at his grave so plain. But we at least have, like, flowers. And then I kept the two little angels. I hope they don't take any of that. Because on their website, they literally only approve, like, so much things. Like, literally, like... They only have like five things on there that they approve and the rest, if it's not on there, they don't approve it. But I brought him his favorite food. Fuck, yo. Oh, let's see him and talk to him. I'll see you guys right now because we need it. I need to vent to my baby. It's literally his favorite, you guys. Look. And then I just got me some right here. Any happy emotions in so long. 
I'm like trying to take it for granted. I'm sitting here telling Gabriel, I'm like, babe, this food is so bad. Like, <laughs> I'm only trying to eat for him, but it's like, I would always tell him to, like, that <laughs> the food would be, like, not good and stuff. Like, to Gabriel, because I have to get going. Because I have a lot of little errands I need to do now, but I like coming in the mornings because it's so peaceful. And I'm sure his parents are gonna come today. Usually they come like in the afternoon, because um, every time I'm here they always pull up and get his food. That I probably am gonna leave, and maybe like if his parents come, I'll let them decide if they wanna like keep it or throw it away. But I miss you a lot, Gabriel. <laughs> I know you know how much I miss you and how much I love you. I still love you a lot. <laughs> Look, I wrote a little heart. <laughs> Put a little heart for you, Daddy.